paper math challenge. What is the largest area and longest perimeter your group can make by using only one roll of toilet paper? You will get to experiment with some toilet paper strips. You will receive one six foot strip of toilet paper. Try different lengths and widths of areas and perimeters with this toilet paper. Hey third graders, I'm Bossy Bradley. And I am Wacky Williams. And I'm Careless Kiebert. And I am Racing Racine. Directions. Guys, just quickly pull it apart and let's go. We need to get this done. I think you should do like divide it. Did you guys see what divide happened in the cafeteria so today? You guys both can have a toy. Where? Did you see them in the cafeteria? What? Did you see no, them? come on. We, no, gotta we need done. to get this done. Oh, come on. Stay on task. I ripped it again. Miss Williams says that I just need, I can't do it. Do you it. not know so how to do it. it? I can't do it. I are you not it? listening and following directions? You guys are time Stop arguing. arguing. Okay, yes, Miss Chrissy. But I'm bossy. All right, so I think we're done, except for the one that Kiebert just ruined. Careless. Now what do we do? It's okay. We could just get you a new one. Okay. Rules. One. One unit of toilet paper must you aside. Two. You must use all toilet paper units. Three, use your teamwork skills. Careful Kiebert. And I'm Reasonable Racine. Okay, so we're going to take it, and I think if we put them all in a line, we'll have the longest, and that'll be the most perimeter. One, two, three, well, kind of ran out of table space. Maybe a, a diagonal will work better. Well, we've run out of room. What do we do next? We can move to the floor. We could go to the floor. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. So, let's see what our perimeter is. Okay. So, all sides have to touch? One side has to one touch. Side one side. Touch. side. Okay. One side, all touch. All right, so let's do, okay. let's do our perimeter starting over there. One, two, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight. Okay, so that's thirty. That's pretty big for a perimeter. That's yeah. Why don't you draw your? Uh, I'll draw, draw it right. right. See how I'm drawing it? Wouldn't it be more? I need 38. A larger area? I don't know. Let's see. Let's count okay. that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Oh. Wow. wow. How did that happen? Hmm. Well. I kind of did something like this. Yeah. Okay. 
Yep, so one side is touching, they share a side. Good. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. like okay, now let's see. Good thinking, Williams. It looks like a bar graph. It does. One, two, two three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten eleven, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Twenty it's already three. bigger. Oh. Okay. I wonder if we could even do another way. We could make it bigger.